Hello everybody, this is Drosko3. I'm here again to show you another mod, another tutorial <laughs> on Halo for Halo Custom Edition. Um, so first you gotta open Halo CE. This time you're going to go type in your quick search. This is going to be for your Halo developer mode. So you're going to have to type in dev, would probably be the quickest search to find it. So now you're going to need a couple things. You're going to need this one right here, Halo C developer mode and you're going to need to click download I already have it but I'm going to just check to see and you're going to open the file and this is the program you're going to do so what you're going to do, you can like basically um, what you could do is basically take it the file and place it anywhere on your desktop and voila you have develop, you have developer mode on your computer, so it is right here and then that's what it looks like page up is to turn it on and page down is to turn it off in the game. I'm going to delete this because I already have it. The next thing you're going to need to make sure you hit open on that one, the next thing you're going to need to make everything work better is Halo C Trainer 3. I believe that's the one I have. And you're going to need, it tells you all the different things of how to use everything. You're going to download that too and you can put that on your hard drive you can put it up here on your desktop or else. I personally put it in on my game folders under Halo Seek under saved right here. The next program you're gonna need is this Halo Fly Cam because it's gonna you're gonna need it to, if you want to film do any filming. So we go back to Halo Custom Edition and you see here there's the Halo Fly Cam version too. Uh, there it is right there. There's the one you want to want get. That's the one I like because that one's easier for me to use. So you're just gonna download it and do the same thing with the other as you did with the other things. So that's all you have to do for that. The next step, I will show you in Halo how to um, do some things with Devi mods. Okay, so you, before you get into Halo, you're gonna need to uh, make sure you turn on the Dev and the Trainer and Halo Fly Cam. So first thing we're gonna do is go to a map and hit Land. And then I'm going to pick, if you have this map, it's EPA30. Or actually, yeah, we're going to go to, yeah, we're going to go there. And click OK. And then OK, OK. So, once, so now that we're in the game, we are ready to use developer mode. You see, it's just one of the maps, random. So you're going to push page up. That allows you to use Devimon. And then you're going to hit the little button above tab that allows you to bring up the screen. F1 turns on deathless and turns it off again. F2 turns on uh, am ammo, <laughs> infinite ammo, turns it off too. F3, unable to fall out of vehicles, and same with the opposite. F4 is a uh, bottomless clip, it means unlimited ammo like this, like what you see here. And then you can turn it off too. F5 uh, makes you jump, be able to jump high, so as with this, makes you able to jump really high. And then die. <laughs> So we turn that off. The next thing, F6. Uh, what was that supposed to do? That makes a semantic view. Turn it off. F7 disables the camera. So if you turn that off, you can move your character around like I do for my films. As you see, the character is able to do stuff like in, ha in the other games. And then we can turn that off again. And you're looking down for some reason. F8. Makes a marine looks like it's a marine recording, so you're looking for like marine's eye. Turn it off. Now F9, you gotta be more careful with. F9, you gotta be gotta careful with, kind of. So we're gonna turn deathless on. And when we hit F9, it spawns a lot of vehicles. That's why I gotta be careful with that one. Yeah. So I'll be right back. Why? So we can't get out now. You see, because there's all the vehicles around. So when we come back, I'll be out of this vehicle mess. Okay, and now I'm back, we just moved. So now F10 spawns all the weapons on the map, as you can see. Every single weapon on the map ever. There probably are some extra weapons like this one right here. Um, kind of weird weapon. Thought it might fall. Okay, and then F11, you're gonna need to show is hold on. So to do F11 you're just gonna need to take your camera off by hitting one and then 
by pushing S and F11, you'll transport your character to wherever you are. And basically, that's most of it. The last one, F12, I'm not going to do because it makes you cloak. So you just hit this and then F12. Now, now the last thing you're going to do, now to do what I've been doing with the characters, what I can do now with the characters, you're going to need to hit this button right here. You're going to type in cheat underscore bump underscore possession one true now all you do is look at whatever character you want and run into them and you're then you become that character so if I want to become uh, ODSC I just run into him and I become the ODSC want to be an elite run into him being an elite that's not how I did it for my other character though when I was um, when I'm some other things this is how you would do it really so yeah and then same with the hunter as well so basically this has been Jurassic 3 hope you this has been Jurassic 3 I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and you're just gonna watch me do whatever I want with my character here and that's it so I'll see you later Oh yeah, before you go, this is what happens when most of my marines die. <laughs> That's how my marines die, though. <laughs>